moving on, <laughs> Tyrese. <laughs> Good day. Yo, Charlemagne and him is crazy, yo. Yo, yo, Charlemagne and him is crazy. The shorty said, the shorty said he took her back to the hood. Somebody getting ready to get married, he said, shorty took her back to the hood. He said, the only way to make sure you know it's real, this how the girl knows it's real when the, when the guy take him back to the hood they from. <laughs> He said, yeah, ASAP Rocky took Rihanna back to the hood. That's how you knew it was real. <laughs> Hilarious. Good day, good day, good day. Yo, I hope everybody's feeling good, feeling rich. It hurt. That's what it's all about. You heard me? Now, anyway, yo, look. Tupac Shakur said, don't trust nobody. Yeah. That's what Tupac Shakur said. Shout out to everybody. Like, comment, and subscribe. Tell them Pac getting ready to go live. Yo, look, man. Uh, if y'all don't know who I am, my name is Pac with the stacks. Y'all know what it is, man. We stacked up over here, you heard? But, um, yeah, Tupac Shakur said, don't trust nobody. We don't care if he said my closest friends did me in. This is what Tupac Shakur said. Don't trust nobody. You see that fake friend, them friends you dapping up? All them type of guys. Let me tell you how you know when you're dealing with some fake shit. You run around all through your day, your course of your day, you run around slapping hands, slapping fives on niggas who when they give you dap, they looking the other way. Yeah, that's your life. See, these are the little things that's going over your head. You're missing them, and you're not noticing. Nobody likes you, bro. It's all fake, my nigga. My nigga. It's all fake. Okay? The homeboys, niggas you, 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 you grew up with. Niggas stealing from you. Your homeboys. It's always somebody you know. There's no such thing as enemies. There's just such thing as frenemies. Yeah. Look at all the rappers. Wow, I gotta think about the ones who wasn't lying, who wasn't backdoored. Damn near all of them was backdoored. By somebody that they rock with. Somebody in they clique, they family, they friend. A female. Julio Fulio Fulio. One of the latest R.I.P. Bless that man. A lot of people don't feel like that. Don't feel like I should be saying that. Fulio Fulio. Biggie Smalls. Tupac, the person I'm talking about. All these people was lined up by people that were supposed to be their friends. People that were supposed to be their brothers. Pop Smoke. They said somebody gave the Addy. Well, they said he did that. They said he, he shared the Addy. But some chick knew something or something. Yeah. Yo. It's the same thing everywhere you go. All the rappers that's been murdered was backdoored by somebody they know. All the people you see on social media acting like they friends, slapping up for five months, and then they're going at each other's necks. It's all fake, it's, nobody, it's no friends. You don't have no friends. I'm talking to you. Who you always, you wake up, you're slapping fives, you're calling your mans up, your mans, your, that's not your mans. You ain't got no friends, nigga. It don't matter how many, how many, how many, how many dollars you make. Doesn't mean nothing. You got no friends. Tupac Shakur said, don't trust nobody. And this is what I live by, bro. Trust nobody. I don't care no more. I don't care about if I knew you 20 years. I don't care about none of that. 
these humans, the, 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 the nature of the human being is disgusting, is backstabbing, betrayal, cheat, lies. Humans, this is the traits. This is the traits of 99.9 humans on this earth. It's always good. It's light switch love, bro. I keep telling y'all niggas the same thing. It's light switch love. That chick that love you got the light on now. It's just on now. That's all it is. When she decided to turn it off, it's all, it's light switch love. Everybody, the person is always, the other person is always in control of, they, of their light switch. What the hell, where do you think you at? Smile when you come in the room. Give you the body language like, 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 like you somebody. All humans know how to do it. We mastered it. Smile when you come in the room. Act like you're somebody special. We all mastered it. We can act like that. Or we can act the other way when you come in the room. We'll just, yeah, come in the room. We mastered how to act. There's no animal or nobody on this earth more conniving, more deceptive, more backstabbing, more lying, more light switch love than a nasty human being. What animal could, could trick you out like a human being? Name one animal that could trick you out the way a human being tricks you out. None. They don't even know how to. Okay? And they do do some little tricks without talking. Like, you pay attention. Like you see some shit like, oh, wow, he did that. Yeah, they know how to do little things, but it's nowhere near the level of a nasty human. So are you nasty humans sitting around calling other nasty humans your friend? It's light switch love, bro. Like that chick. That chick, that's what you light switch, man. She loved you for 40 years and then turned her switch off. Fuck you. Yeah. Light switch love. Call it light switch love. On, off, or off, off. Turn it off right now. Yo, we love you. Turn it off. Fuck that nigga. It's fake out here. You ain't got no friends. Let me tell you something. Let me tell you how to trick a nigga into a toxic lifestyle. This is how you trick niggas, a couple niggas into a, a toxic lifestyle. You say, yo, I can't wait till these niggas fall out. I can't wait till these, watch these niggas have some problems and shit. You know what that's going to do? That's going to make them pretend like everything's good forever with them. But on the behind the scenes, they talk about each other. They steal from each other. They're scheming on conniving little backstabbing ways. But they'll never... Let the world know as much as possible because they want to make you feel like everything is all good. Same thing with bitching niggas. You got a female and a guy. They want to, everybody they show their relationship is good because they built this thing. Sometimes you could do a little thing and look like you're cool for a certain amount of time where people start to accept it. Yeah, they accept it. They say, yo, you know what? Them, 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 they, yo, they cool now. Them two, them three, them, see them four guys right there? They brothers. So once you, once you got the world believing this and the world shows you ways that they believe y'all a certain way, you got to keep that act up. You know how many relationships, how many of these sorry niggas is out here with girlfriends and girls is with they man because they family got the look in their eyes like, yo, he's good for you. Yeah, Pac, you the illest on YouTube. You the illest on YouTube, Pac. Pac with the stacks. If y'all know who I am, they call me Pac with the stacks. You heard? But, um... Do you know how many relationships is like that? You only, you only keep him this person around you. I know there's a lot of people out there right now saying, Oh, wow, he just said something. Ew, 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 ew talk. How many of y'all is in relationship because your family 
Your family think you're with a good man. And you know he's a piece of crap. But your family feel like, no, don't do that. He's You got a good one, I'm telling you. And you're like, yo, what do y'all see in this bozo? Because she don't see it. Sometimes situations force you to stay in situations that you don't really want to be in. It looks like that, but you know it's not, it don't feel good. How many of y'all is out there living that life? Oh, we, wow, wow. See, there's so many different aspects of life that you could be smashing a nigga facing. And he can't compare to you in this area or that area. It's wild aspects. Don't let a bozo fool you and make you think it's one or two aspects. You see me sitting in the car and I figured out life. No. No. You see somebody with a shape up and a and, thousand and dollars and they figured out life. No, nigga. No, nigga. Who do you think, who do these guys think they gonna come on YouTube, have two small aspects in life figured out, and they got the whole pie figured out. Boy, you better go bump your head on the ceiling. See, sometimes you gotta realize you're talking to the wrong people. Sometimes you gotta remember who you talking to. Certain people believe that bullshit. There's certain people believe in that boy. You see a nigga get fresh. You see a nigga with a rod. You see a nigga with a little shorty, a little cocksucker on the side. A little different cocksucker every now and again. You got a little different cocksucker on the side of your, your, your passenger seat. A little different cocksucker. Right? And you think you got it all figured out. Boy, his life is in shambles. You got so many aspects of life. Y'all better go back home. Y'all better go back home. See, that's the problem. That's the problem right there. Y'all, y'all look at too many things on face value. Y'all face this is the real one of the realest videos I ever did. Y'all look at everything as face value. Facts. Like, comment, and subscribe. You heard? Let's get to this. Let's get to this. Let's get to this. You could get with this, or you could get with that. You could get with this so you can get with that. You could get with this or you could get with that. You could get with this. Cause this is where it's at. <laughs> yeah, nigga. Yeah, don't say no. Yeah, don't say no, nigga. Yeah. Yeah, nigga, don't say no. Tupac said don't trust nobody. That's what Tupac Shakur said. That's who I'm listening to. I look at that video, man, from years ago. When you look at a video from years ago, it's hit different. I swear to God, I'll cry right now. I'll cry right now like Hassan Campbell on the camera. I swear to God. And I ain't no diss. Because that's how I feel. That's how I feel. I could cry right now. I could cry right now. Tupac Shakur said, don't trust him. No, but do you know what nobody, that mean that nasty, stink ass nigga sitting next to you. He said, don't trust him. <laughs> that nigga that, that nigga that got your name in his mouth. <laughs> oh shit! I tell you, see, look, when certain when you see certain things in this world, this world, and when you see certain stuff, I hope y'all replay every word I say. You're gonna learn some if you do. When you see certain things in this world. And you know you got to play chess and make the right moves and everything and all that stuff. You better know there's a certain move that you can do that really is a safe move. It's called retreat. See, you niggas don't know how to retreat. <laughs> you one of those animals. You see the animals on, on online getting ate. 
Do you see the animals? For the animal TV, nigga. You see the animals. The animals are eating each other. <laughs> That's what we do it out here, y'all. It's a doggy world, doggy dog. <laughs> subscribe, like, comment, subscribe. You know I'm live. Pack is live. Pack with the stacks, nigga. Pack with the stacks. Stop playing with me, boy. You know how I feel right now? Yo, listen. Let me tell you something. It's a dog eat with dog. The animals are eating each other on YouTube. The animals are eating each other all the while. <laughs> Yo, nigga will eat you alive, nigga. Do you understand what I'm saying? I'm gonna bring some different videos. Wait till I got some. Hey, look, I have new things coming to the channel. Pack with the stacks. You can get with this, or you can get with that. I got new things coming to the channel that's gonna really ooh, 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 ah, y'all. Y'all gonna love it. But what I wanna tell you is, it's a dog eat dog world, man. You understand? It's a dog eat dog world. The animals are eating each other on YouTube. And guess what? They're eating each other alive. The same way these guys are doing on YouTube. The animals, you know, you're gonna see people saying stuff that I say right now. You know, they on me, but I don't care when they bite me now. I got a new trick for you. Keep copying me. I got a new trick for you. Keep copying me. Keep it up. Keep it up. I got you. I got something for you. I got something for you. Okay. Now, when you look at the animals on on there and they eat each other, you see the the the, the Kamala. They eat the deer alive. I watched it yesterday. I just watched it. He was eating them alive. He was going back. <laughs> Yo, I'm not, I don't know why I'm laughing right now. I'm laughing at the joke part of me making the joke. Watching it. They eating out the stomach, the guts, while the thing is laying there going. It's a lot. It's getting eaten alive. These are what these guys are doing on YouTube. They're eating each other alive. They're breathing. Yo, I, you hear the death cry, man. It's called the death cry. Death crowd, Tupac said, Don't trust that nigga. That's what Tupac said. Yeah. You listening to him or you listening to Tupac? Shakur. I'm listening to Tupac. I don't trust nobody. I don't care who you are. I don't care. I'm not entertained by the title. See, you y'all entertained by the title. I don't care what the title is. I don't trust you. That could be crazy. Everybody I trust uh made me made me believe that I shouldn't have trusted them. You get along better in life if you're not trusting somebody. I, they do whatever they ask, they pull, they pull, whatever they pull. Hey, I never trusted your ass anyway. <laughs> Yeah, it hit different. I never trusted your nasty ass anyway. So it don't matter. But when you get that love, and that trust, and that loyalty, all that other, all that other fake lying stuff people tell you to do for nothing. You got some people out here that feel like, yo, if, 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 if I bless you with my presence, you got to do everything else. If I bless you with my presence, you got some people out here that feel like they, if they feel like they big enough to wear, yo, if I just bless you with my presence, 
you got to be doing everything else. You know, the type of people that end up in bad situations, bro. You know, I ain't got to say nothing bad about, the, about nobody who, who feel like that. They going to make their own bed. That's all. Sometimes you just let somebody make their own bed. You ain't got to really do too much. Let them make their own bed because they the ones who got to lay in it. Yeah, you made your bed, now sleep. You made your bed. That's how you chose to make your bed. You thought the way you made your bed didn't matter. Some people think the way they make their bed for the morning don't matter. Make your bed. Take the time and make your bed right. Because if you don't make your bed right, when you lay in it, you ain't going to have a good night sleep night. You know what I'm saying? So that's what you pay attention to. Pay attention to how you make your bed. You ain't making your bed right. You gonna sleep in it. You gonna, you gonna have not a good night's sleep. You see what I'm saying? Well, it's real out here, y'all. Tupac Shakur said don't trust nobody. Don't trust him. Don't trust him. You see what's going on on YouTube? Everybody who been backdoored, every rapper that was murdered, you go down a the list. There was backdoored by somebody that knows them. It's just a matter of time. Tupac said, stay to yourself. Stay to yourself, be by yourself. Da -da -da -da. This is what Tupac Shakur said, the, one of the best rap artists of our time in the world. One of the best. He just gave me the game. I'm giving it to you. Stay by yourself. You see a lot of people, they run around slapping fives with people that slap and give them a dap. Don't even, I told you that. This is giving you daps, not even looking in your face no more. What up, bro? Nigga. That's what y'all experiencing out there. That's the lives y'all experience. These are the type of people you put in your, you sort of surround yourself with, you hang with, you, you, you kick the shit with, you talk with all day, you do. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. You ain't going nowhere. You gotta remember, just keep in mind, don't trust nobody. Tupac Chacon said, don't trust none of these niggas. Okay? Stay by yourself. Do your thing. Ain't hey, there's nobody to trust. The people be looking for love in all the wrong places. That's what the problem is. There's too many niggas scared to be by themselves. They're scared to be alone. Scared to run road dolo. Scared to do this. Scared to do that by themselves. A lot of people wouldn't be in problems and situations if they did whatever they did by themselves. Wake up out there. Tupac Shakur said, don't trust nobody. Don't trust none of these niggas. Remember, the haters' hope is real. Haters is going to hope. All they're going to do is sit back and hope. Start talking. The more you doing better, the more they're going to start talking. The more they're going to start hoping. Well, sit over there, you dusty ass, and hope, nigga. Because ain't nothing going to happen but your worst nightmare. Me, rich and famous. Right? Make sure you know that. Make sure you make their worst nightmare come true. Make sure you make their worst nightmare come true. And I told y'all from the previous video, my the, the, uh, people's worst nightmare, right? I told y'all that, right? People's worst nightmare is watching you win. Worst nightmare of everybody. I watched it. From different angles. Oh, that, look, look at him. That's his worst nightmare. Oh, look. That's his worst nightmare. Oh, look at him. That's his worst nightmare. These nasty people got certain targets on people that they made their personal nightmare. If that person wins, ooh, it hurts their heart. Well, be, if anybody that got me not wanting me to win, I'm already up. I already got bread. My money's up. 
How does that feel me telling you that? It's all about life. It ain't nothing going on. What are you going to do? Relax. The day is going by. My money's up. I'm not broke. Sit with that. <laughs> Sit with that. Because that's, that's the only thing that hurts. That's the only thing that hurts me. He's not broke. He's not stressed. Oh, man. He's not stressed. He's not broke. That's their whole life, yo. You ain't even got to be a millionaire. Just don't be broke and they're mad. <laughs> just, just have a couple of dollars more. Just have more money than them. <laughs> and they are extremely furious at this point. In real time. <laughs> <laughs> yo, when they, they people see it and they know it, they like, yo, in real time, this thing is. <laughs> yeah. These people are upset, buddy. What's wrong with you? Oh, it's a great day. So listen when you see Tupac Shakur talk and you hear them stories and all that. He told you my closest friends, my buddies, people I put in the game, people I put on, changed their lives, did everything for them. They backstabbers. Backstabbers. Ain't got no friends, bro. None of them. The guy who brings you the boot the weed. Yo, what up, son? Uh, be careful. That'll be the nigga to get your address out. That weed nigga. Nah, I be bringing it away. It's some simple shit. The Chinese guy in the Chinese restaurant. Yeah, he come here every day. He come over here every day. He come right here every day. <laughs> Yo, <coughs> it be the simplest shit. The back, the simplest dudes, simplest situation that backstab you, catch you out there, backdoor you. The Chinese guy, he come in here every day. She try po fa rai, po fa rai, fa rai. French fry, po fa rai, four chicken wing, po fa rai. Four chicken wing, po fa rai, every day. <laughs> every day, four chicken wing, po fa rai, but I see, the I see. <laughs> Pack with the stacks, yo. Pack with the stacks. Yo, pack with the stacks. Pack with the stacks, baby. What's up? What we doing? Pack with the stacks, bro. We outside, you heard? Everything's good, yo. Super chat on deck. Everything on deck, you heard? Everything on deck, you heard? I ain't gonna wild nobody up on the internet today, yo. I told myself I ain't gonna wild nobody up on the internet. Only thing I'm gonna do is tell people. Yo, hey yo, Tupac Shakur said, don't trust nobody. See what I'm saying? So all the stuff you see, all these people, just give it, just, just eat your popcorn and watch. Or you can force them into a toxic relationship. <laughs> yeah, I'm playing chess. We playing chess out here, man. I'm like, I've got time to play with you guys. Any way you go with it, I'm playing chess on you, bro. I, I, I can't wait to see some of these niggas argue and fight. <laughs> I can't wait to see some of these niggas argue and fight. <laughs> That's how you force a nigga in a toxic situation, a toxic relationship. Because now they're going to do everything in the world to make sure to you, Everything is beautiful. See, behind the scenes, toxic relationship. Yeah. That's how you put. You know how many girls and guys is running around together in toxic situations? I told you that already. <laughs> because they done made somebody else believe that they everything is so beautiful. So now they can't show them nothing bad. What? Mike and Jane, they arguing and fighting. Who 
Janet and Jeff had an argument. You know how many times y'all hear something? Yo, yo, you remember Janet and Jeff? Yeah, I know Janet and Jeff. You know they broke up, right? Stop the music, bro. Stop the music. Do you know? Wait, hold up. They will stop. Yo, they will go to their boss and tell the boss they need a 15-minute break before lunchtime. Yeah. I, you got to, You can't be serious right now. Janet and Jeff broke up. Jan D. Janet and D. Jeff? The perfect relationship? You can't be serious. No. I was going to have a baby in six months. Now I'm going to tell, now she's going to tell her husband she don't want to have the baby no more. They was going to get married next month. Now they're calling the wedding off. This is how serious it is when you paint a picture for people's face and how much effort people put into not showing a different picture because they already painted that picture. Yeah! I'm the producer, I'm the predictor. I'm the life predictor. I predict what stuff like this was going on. I don't care about explaining nothing. You want to explain something, go to court. Explain out of that. That's where they explain shit. I predict what's gonna happen. Damn, boom, ba, boom. This was gonna take place, nigga. See what I'm saying? There's a difference. Everything is always on a bigger level, is what I'm trying to tell you. So watch all these people out here that's painting pictures. If they already got painted pictures, permanent ink they use to, to paint these little pictures, they gonna go hard, they paint. They gonna go hard to paint and paint everything so that picture don't change. You understand what I'm trying to tell y'all? I'm teaching y'all right now. Go back, I'm just using the relationships as an analogy of what's going on. You know how many people break up? What? Tyrone broke up with his baby mother? Tyrone broke up with the one he had Six kids, wait. I never, I never thought I'd see the day. You painted a picture for 30 years. You don't want the public and the people around you that know you that the picture changed. You're living a whole new life here in a whole new space. Certain things takes place and lets the people know that you're in a whole new space. You don't, people don't want people to know their business like that, like they're in a whole new space. Well, you're living in a whole new space and they, there's no way to deny it. So understand what's going on, y'all. I hope y'all learned something from this video today. And I hope y'all learned something from Tupac Shakur saying, Don't trust nobody. It's only a matter of time. And if I love you, don't take it lightly. <laughs>